the mornings are the best part of the homesteading it's just so nice the the birds the spring birds have came and i could be listening to them for hours no problem it's so great when you can dif differentiate between one and the other bird and kind of pinpoint their nesting there's gonna be a couple of them nesting around my small farm here so I'm doing this part mostly um, sitting here drinking coffee not wasting your time but I'm trying to say that thank you very much we got another I think it's eight or nine subscribers you guys been commented on my videos and it's given me the motivation to do more videos and I'm really happy I didn't believe that anybody anyone would be even watching this videos so I'm I'm just trying to say thank you a lot for uh, all the subscriptions and uh, support I didn't have much time because I had so much work it's just so much work it took me the whole week just to get the lumber um, to saw it in half to put it in place uh, what else was I doing I was doing the solar I was doesn't matter you guys are gonna see it in the videos so thank you again And now this is the difference. As you can see, they trampled and they've eaten all the sprouts. Now this is for three days of work. Three days of work for them. Put some salt stone there for them to lick. And if tomorrow wouldn't be raining, I would already Put the fence over here. Are they gonna clear all this thing up? Everything is gonna be cleared. And then I will re dig it. I will re dig it, and after it's gonna be re dug, potentially there's gonna be grass. And when there's gonna be grass, there could be sheep or a cow. It would be even better if I put a pig first, but there's so many hikers here, I don't trust the, having a pig. People could let it out and stuff. And that is my treasure. Four eggs now. I'm rotating them. So that the me membrane is not stuck to the wall, to the walls of the egg, to the shell. And this is the, uh, the solar panel tower. <laughs> but it works. A meter and a half high, I actually get, because of these trees here, I'm getting an hour more of a sunlight. There is another video you guys will be able to see what, an, what big an impact 
and the chickens did on the garden, which is amazing. This is the new hen house. And and it's gonna be it's gonna be for a hundred meat chickens actually, which they're gonna come out and be pastured through during the day. Till now, it cost me about five liters of gasoline. So the cost is gonna go up after I buy the the net for the front and the planks to cover the floor and the sides. Let's see if the pig's gonna come out. Oh, she's digging. She's digging a hole. That's not ideal. The problem is that the geese have nests here. And I think she... And I'm pretty sure she can smell the eggs on the other side. One of the eggs went missing already, so I put like a put a tree stump there to protect it. But we'll see.
Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on.